Good morning, everyone. This is Marcia Zavala, and I've been working my way through the alphabet, and this week's letter is the letter U. So if you don't know, I am a physical therapist. I've been a PT for over 22 years. I've been diving into the nutrition world for, oh gosh, over 10 years. Um, it kind of all started with my youngest son, who is now 15. Um, but I really started digging into it like about 10 years ago. Um, that all started with trying to do an Ironman triathlon. Well, I did finish it, but there's, there's a lot of reasons for that. Anyways, today's letter is the letter U. And U is for euphoria. Okay, so if you have been following this series, I have been occasionally, when it's appropriate, talking about a specific supplement that my husband um, was told about and now uses and has had amazing results. And I just kind of wanted to explain a little bit about this supplement plus other ones. So this is kind of a supplement post, but it's also going to be more about why you shouldn't buy supplements off the shelf and you know and why you should look into actually personalizing them either through a nutritionist that's what i do um through this specific one that i'm going to talk about wait hang on through this one and a couple of others that i use that are supplements but they help you in different ways okay so where are we going to start let me get to my notes here okay did you know that if you are a smoker and you take antioxidants to prevent the damage that the smoking has done or has done, just some random, you know, hey, I off the shelf, I heard this does this and that does that, that you actually increase your chances for lung cancer. They discovered this um, back in the 90s that actually smokers who were trying to take supplements to reverse some of the damage that they had done actually increased there was increased rates of lung cancer i bring that up because so many people um i have some family members um one who's probably going to watch this has a stockpile of vitamins and minerals thinking they're going to do better you know it's going to help them and it's just kind of like you're throwing stuff at it and you don't even know what you're really getting so unless you have somebody that's guiding you specifically on what supplements to take, um, physician, uh, nutritionist, um, you know, another healthcare professional that actually understands how these work and isn't just throwing things at you, then you could actually be causing more damage than good. Okay. So go take a look in your medicine cabinet. And, um, when you look at it, look and say, okay, Am I taking this just because I heard it's going to do X, Y, or Z? Or am I taking this because I know that I'm deficient? Or I know that it's going to help a specific thing? So with the current world that we're starting to kind of climb out of, um, there were certain regimens that were um, established in order to boost your immune system. And I should not use that word boost, but to strengthen your immune system appropriately. Because I've had a post before where I talk about immunity and you don't necessarily want your immune system boosted because that can mean it goes out of whack. So there's a lot of fine tuning to this and yes, it's verbiage, but I think it's important to understand that. Okay, so I'm gonna talk, start with saying that unless you know you're deficient, you should probably not be taking something. Um, so unless you know that you a healthcare provider of some sort who is very knowledgeable and just because they graduated from med school doesn't necessarily mean they understand all the ins and outs of supplementation. That is something that people spend time and years in the professional setting understanding. Okay, so we're going to start with this one because I've talked about this a lot. This is called euphoria and I think you've probably seen this little symbol on things. What euphoria is, is it is a DNA based supplement. Okay, it, they go in and you do um, a saliva swab and then you send it back and they have two specific labs that are like uh, the pathology lab and another lab that I'm going to put all of this in the notes on the specifics that are the highest ranking laboratories for looking at DNA. That's who they use. And then it goes in and then discovers what your body may be having problems with. Now, they go and look at these things called SNPs. A SNP is a single nucleotide polymorphism, OK? 
okay? A SNP determines your hair color, your eye color, your skin color, um, but there's also SNPs that will determine how your body is able to use certain nutrients through biochemical pathways, okay? That just means, is your body able to absorb what you're actually taking? Does it need more of it because it's dysfunctional, we'll say? Does it need an alternative because it can't even use that specific one? That's where euphoria is so different than anything else we've ever come across, and that's why I just talk so much about it. Now, before I get into some more of this, um, when my husband first started taking it, the person who introduced it to him had multiple sclerosis plaques on imaging. After taking the euphoria for, I think it was either three or six months, those plaques were no, what's that? 90 days. After they were taking it for 90 days, the plaques were no longer there. Okay. If you have come across something that does this, please let me know because as a PT of 22 years, I've had many multiple sclerosis patients. I have never heard of or seen anything like this. My husband in the medical field for the same amount of time, roughly, we've never heard of anything like this, of something like that reversing because of supplementation. Um, so that's just kind of our over 20 years, over 40 years combined of experience. If you think about that, that makes me sound really old. Um, so if you can find something that is going to go based off of specifically you, why wouldn't you try it? Okay. Um, and this, I'm not trying to sell this to you. I'm just more trying to discourage you from doing off the shelf supplementation. Um, you know, I've got a few other things that I'll talk about very briefly as well, but the way this one works is depend. De depending upon your specific genetic code on the ability to utilize a vitamin or mineral and it goes based off of um hang on i've got some categories for you. like lipid support mitochondrial function a healthy weight vitamin b12 immune system it just it has 18 different categories that it goes through and it looks at how your body is able to utilize minerals and whether or not you need a specific vitamin or mineral and in what quantities that's the other thing too is it's not just you know the generic take one tablet at breakfast lunch and dinner with a meal or on an empty stomach it's very specific to you you know that's what makes it so different so what euphoria does is it replaces standing in the supplement aisle going huh okay well this one says it's good for my immune function i guess i should take that and this one says it's going to help me sleep so i should probably take that which you guys already know there's a whole different route for sleep that requires zero money um, I'll link that in, in this article. So if you have not already subscribed to uh, my emails, make sure you do that because then I have all these links that you can go back and look on previous posts that I've written about things like sleep and supplementation. I've got a very long post about supplementation that I did about a year ago. Um, and that was prior to us knowing about this. So, but it still works together. So what there are some concerns about with this with people that I want to dispel is it does not change your genetic makeup. It just, it does not do that. It just looks at it, tells it how to be more efficient and how to fill in the gaps. It does not replace eating good food. It does not mean that this is your thing to go eat Twinkies and Ho-Hos all day long with a gallon of diet soda. It doesn't replace that. All it does is fill in the gaps. What it does not include is not, does not include hormones, probiotics, prebiotics, or enough vitamin D if you are low. It does have some vitamin D, but it is not going to, um, it, it's not going to have enough. So that may be something you need to supplement. It does not replace visiting your physician routinely and getting some lab work done to find out where you are everywhere across the board. Okay. So this fills in gaps. Okay. That's what this does. Now, there's other products that you guys have heard me talk about, and I'm trying to find, I don't know where my other little thing went. That's okay. It's called Plexus, and it is this pink drink, which is prebiotic fiber. I gotta find this because I don't know where it went. Oh, well. Um, it's a pink drink that is prebiotic fiber, and then it has this, which is this probio 5, which is the probiotics. Now, the reason I settled on this one, and there is a plethora of probiotics out there, including homemade ones, is this one specifically uses the actual amount studied in the research. So you can hear, you've heard of lactobacillus, that's in yogurt. However, 
half the time what's in yogurt doesn't always make it to where it needs to go, which is your small intestine, that it's not always protected through your stomach acid. Now your stomach acid is going to break down a lot of that and you might get parts of it that actually make it down. What this does is it survives and it gets to where it needs to go so it can repopulate the good bacteria in your gut. The prebiotic fiber feeds the good bacteria that's already in your gut. And then there's a third step that gets rid of any of the bad bacteria that has been killed off. So it's a three-step system that we use. Know and love. I've talked about it a lot. So Plexus goes in and seals up your gut appropriately with in stabilizing the microbiome in your gut. So you want the good guys, get rid of the bad guys, and you know flush out the bad guys. So, it, But it's not a laxative, so don't think of it like that. Okay, and then the other supplement that I like to use is called Vespa. Okay, so there's actually two, well, there's a third one that's a concentrate, but that's more like race day kind of stuff. This is something that I found out, and this is kind of something that also kickstarted my real dig deep dive into nutrition. What this does is it helps you use your body fat for fuel. Now it is incorporated in eating a, a little bit different diet. That's how I kind of got turned on to the paleo diet. Um, that was gosh, about 11 years ago, maybe around then 11 or 12 years ago. And what this does is it basically, it's like a catalyst and it helps you use your fat stores for fuel. So now for those of you who think that you've got to you know, do all these carb loading, especially my runners, no, you don't need to. You've got plenty of fuel that's much more stable, that's not gonna make you do this kind of a thing, and it stabilizes. I love it. Um, I, you know, I try to get people in the jiu-jitsu world to understand that not only does it help you not have those highs and lows, but it also helps you think clearer because the sugar, you're not relying on a sugar source for your brain fuel as well. So it's just a much more stable route all around. Okay. So euphoria is fills in the gaps. Plexus heals up your gut and then Vespa helps you use your fat for fuel. Okay. Those are my three things that I love. Yes. I title it you is for euphoria, but it's, this is a supplement talk. Um, Quit going down the aisles of the sun, you know, wherever you are and just randomly picking stuff. If you don't know that you need it, vitamin toxicity is a real thing, okay? Just because it says it's, you know, water swallower or you can pee it out, doesn't mean that it's not harmful on your kidneys. Your liver has to process almost everything first. You are causing your liver to be a little stressed out. So if you are, you know, if you have symptoms of, all sorts of symptoms. I'm not going to go into that one because there are so many symptoms that could mean that your liver is a little bogged down and you need to give it a break. So quit with the extra supplements that you don't even know if you need. Okay. For more information, you guys, I can help you out with this. This is what I do. Um, my husband and I make a great team and we help people change their lives through lifestyle, diet, nutrition. And, um, he's obviously the metal, the super smart medical piece to this. Um, but if you guys want help, trying to figure out your diet, just let me know and you can find me on all the social media sites. Um, go to my website, that's uptodatenutrition.com and that's with the number two. And you know, contact me there and let me see what I can do to help you guys out. Okay, have a great rest of your Wednesday. I hope you learned a little bit something and quit taking so many vitamins you don't even know if you need. Okay, have a great day, bye. Mm -hmm.